In this video I'm going to show you seven effective home remedies to get rid of bed bugs fast. Bed bugs are small, around 5 mm in size. They are visible to the human eye but only jest. They are oval shaped, flat and rusty brown in colour. Unlike other bugs they cannot jump or fly. They crawl around from dark crevices at night to feed on blood which results in those infamous bed bug bites. Although they won't spread any disease, they can be uncomfortable and some people will experience a reaction to their bites. Females lay up to 250 eggs during their lifetime of about 2 to 4 months. Eggs are laid in cracks and crevices and are oval and white in colour. So what causes bed bugs? Contrary to popular belief, bed bugs don't have anything to do with dirt, so an extra shower a day won't keep them at bay. Bed bugs feed on blood. Anywhere where animals or humans are technically is an ideal place for them to set up camp. Bed bugs move from place to place after feeding and can hide in anything from bed sheets to your t-shirt. So what are the signs of bed bugs? Besides actually catching them crawling across your sheets, there are several other signs of bed bugs to look out for, including bites on skin, small black spots on your bed sheets, that's the bug faeces, bed bug shells, they shed their skin much like snakes, a musty smell in your bedroom or blood spots. These could occur if you unintentionally squish a bug in your sleep. So how do you prepare for bed bug treatment? You need to remove the clutter. Despite their name, bed bugs don't solely reside in your sheets. They could be hiding in your cardboard boxes or under the bed or in clothes in your laundry basket. Before you try to treat bed bugs, you should need to get rid of as much clutter as possible. Replace cardboard boxes for plastic boxes, put all of your clothes in a sealed bin liner and do the same with soft furnishings of any kind. Another major precaution is deep clean items that could be infested. Everything that could have bed bugs must be cleaned thoroughly. This means heat treating clothing and sheets in a tumble dryer or placing them in a freezer overnight before laundering them is normal, both of which will kill bed bugs. Any furniture in your bedroom should also be examined for evidence of bed bugs and cleaned as necessary. Curtains should be removed and cleaned professionally and the whole room should be vacuumed thoroughly. It's extremely important to keep all cleaned items in sealed plastic bags. The vacuum bag should also be removed after use, placed in a sealed plastic bag and disposed of. You need to also keep in mind what's hiding under your sheets. Bed bugs are so called because they bite at night. Although they don't always live in the mattress, they often do. Moving your bed away from the wall, furniture and anything else will make infestation anywhere else less likely. Remember to vacuum the area as well. The last step before you start treatment is to completely vacuum on, in and around the affected area. Vacuum your bed thoroughly, not only concentrating on the mattress but the headboard and slats too. Once all that's done you'll be ready to treat your bed bugs using these home remedies. The first and most obvious is a professional bed bug infestation treatment and that's the most reliable way of guaranteeing the full extermination of bed bugs. If you do prefer to try a DIY treatment before shedding out any cash, give these following home remedies a go. Number 1. You can starve the bed bugs. If you don't mind taking the slow and steady route, starving your bed bugs is another option. First and foremost it's important to vacuum your bed thoroughly, next you'll need to get hold of a ziplock bag or similar and zip up your mattress and leave it for around a week. This will prevent any bugs from getting out and feeding, thus causing them to starve to death. Number 2 is diatomaceous earth. This is often considered the most effective of all natural bed bug treatments, killing more than 90% of bed bugs. It's also cheap and easy to use. In its powdered form it can be easily sprinkled into even the most smallest of cracks and crevices. The downside is it can take up to 10 days for it to work. To use apply 100% diatomaceous earth onto the affected area and leave it for a few days. You should slowly start to see dead bed bugs when you vacuum away. Repeat the process several times until all the bed bugs appear to have been eradicated. Number 3 is bicarbonate of soda. 
Here's another reason why it's handy to have a pot of baking soda in the home, it can kill bed bugs. Sprinkling bicarbonate of soda onto the areas affected by bed bugs is thought to physically dehydrate their skin, whilst others suggest it's abrasive enough to cut them. It's cheap, it works, so what's the downside? Treating bed bugs with baking soda is timely. You'll need to repeat the process of sprinkling and vacuuming regularly in order to banish them. This in turn means you're going to need a lot of powder, making this home remedy more expensive than it may have originally seemed. Number 4. Tea Tree Essential Oils Tea tree oil is used in many home remedies, especially those concerning pests. When it comes to bed bugs, tea tree oil not only works to kill them, but also to mask the human smells that would usually attract them. Best of all, tea tree oil is easy to get hold of and is an inexpensive solution to an infestation. All you need to do is dilute 20 drops of the all natural pure tea tree oil with 200 millilitres of water and spray it onto the affected areas. Number 5. Vinegar Vinegar is as strong as it smells when it comes to banishing bed bugs. It's also something most of us have in our homes, making it an ideal emergency home remedy to use. However, it's important to remember that whilst vinegar will kill bed bugs by damaging their nervous system, it won't do anything for the eggs. Saturate the edges of the infected area, such as underneath and around furniture, with white distilled vinegar, and then directly onto bed bugs. This way, when they flee, they won't be able to escape the vinegar. Number 6. Rubbing Alcohol Another popular home remedy for bed bugs is rubbing alcohol. Rubbing alcohol is a solvent and can kill insects by dissolving their cells. Rubbing alcohol is also a drying agent, so it can destroy bed bugs' eggs by drying them out. In addition, rubbing alcohol repels the bugs, discouraging them from crawling or laying eggs on a surface treated with the substance. Because of this, spraying bedding and furniture with rubbing alcohol has gained a reputation as an effective tactic in battling bed bugs. However, research has shown that it's only about 50% effective in killing the bugs, and it can leave stains on your mattress. Number 7. Borax Boric acid is a mineral salt often called sodium borate. It is used for many household cleaning purposes. Borax is another quick and easy way to treat bed bugs. Borax is simply the substance when it's dried out. It kills the bugs by suffocating them. So generously sprinkle borax on the mattress and then spray it with water. Borax is also useful when it comes to washing the affected items. Add some to your washing machine to ensure those bugs are gone for good. So how do you get rid of bed bugs using a pesticide? Using pesticides is the quickest DIY method for treating bed bugs. Before you start spraying, you'll need to prepare the area. Next, you'll need to pick up a pesticide to kill any of the bed bugs hiding in and around your mattress. Spray the pesticide all over the mattress, including around the corners and in the seams. Next, spray the bed, including the headboard slats and inside any drawers, making sure to get right in the corners. If you have a particularly bad infestation, you may see some bed bugs emerging from their hiding spots in an attempt to flee the poison. After an hour or so, vacuum the entire bed once more to remove any dead bed bugs. Keep a close eye on things over the next following days and carry out additional treatments as necessary. Remember, prevention is better than the cure. Here is a few things you can do to stop bed bugs infestate in your home. Number one, vacuum regularly. Vacuuming is one of the easiest ways to remove any stray bed bugs. Whilst it's not enough to deal with a whole infestation, vacuuming regularly will go some way to keeping the area bug free. Number two, check secondhand furniture. When bringing secondhand furniture into your home, you should always consider what's lurking inside. Always check for any signs of bed bugs before purchasing anything. Number three, take precautions when using the laundrette. Bed bugs travel in furniture and on clothes. If you share laundry facilities, you should always take extra precautions to avoid picking up anyone else's bugs. Always transport clothes to and from the laundrette in sealed plastic bags and leave them out for as little time as possible. Hope you've enjoyed this video on home remedies for bed bugs.
If you have, please subscribe to my YouTube channel and don't forget to give this video the thumbs up. And I'm sure you're going to enjoy this next video on 15 ways to get rid of dust mites. Thanks for watching and bye for now.